Welcome back to the shooting channel and welcome back to another one of my gun reviews. As it's the game season, I've got uh, an AYA gun uh, that I've never done before. I've done lots of 12 balls before, I've done lots of number twos, but this is a number one 20 bore side lock. They generally you will pick them up for three to four thousand pounds depending on their condition. New, these are now about fifteen thousand pounds. This specific gun came in um, back in July. It's been through somebody's workshop. It's completely been tidied up. The stock, all the checkering has been very, very smartened up, tidied up. It's got drop points. It's straight hand stock, side lock, and again, they're hand engraved. So the, in Spain, the, the engraver has basically, if you look here, also he's actually signed it in very fine detail. It's got hand detachable locks. It's quite high in the comb. It's 14 and three quarters, quarter and three quarter choke. And if I take it apart, it's still in completely original condition. It's, you can even see on here the, the serial number and the date when it came in. And it's just one of those guns that I wanted to, I've never done before, I wanted to have a shoot and see what it's like. Has anyone got an AYA number one 20 ball? Comment below, what do you think of it? Um, if you've got a number, a number one 12 ball, potentially, one of these could be a good a good set for you to go alongside with your 12 ball. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and shoot it and then I'm going to have a little chat while I shoot it and just see what it shoots like. So I've come to a stand here at Oxford um, to just have a little test with the AYA number two 20 bore. And I'm just gonna shoot a couple of pairs and then I'm gonna talk about what I feel the gun is and how I, how I like the gun. And I'm gonna talk about the pros and cons about shooting a 20 bore at game shooting and at clay shooting. Paul? Paul? So I've just had three or four pairs with it and I'm going to be honest the biggest thing that I realise is a lot of people talk about 20 bores and side by sides recalling and I'm using Ely 24 gram fibre wad cartridges and there is no recall so all this myth about uh, 20 bores and side by sides having big recall if you use a sensible cartridge if you use a sensible cartridge, it ain't, it's not going to recall. The only thing I would say with this is it takes a little bit of getting used to because the whole gun, the whole slimness of the gun is a lot smaller than the 12 bore. Um, so it just takes a little bit. When you're mounting that gun, you've got to think to yourself into your cheek and you've got to think to yourself there because everything here is smaller. So that's the only thing. But it is something that I would really recommend 
going out and, and going to your local shooting school and getting a lesson. If you're thinking about buying a 20 ball side by side or an AYA 20 ball, have a lesson with a, a shooting school. They will teach you how to actually shoot the gun correctly and how to get your head and where to put your head onto that stock. So, just a couple more. Pull. 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 And there you have it. The other thing I will just, just, just comment on is the balance of the gun is very, very centralized. So it's not got stock bow heavy, it's not stock heavy, it's not bow heavy. Again, the 28 inch barrels really do suit this gun down to a T and well. So, I hope you've enjoyed this film. Please comment below. I'd love to hear your thoughts on what you think of the AYA 20 bore side by side. And if you are thinking of buying one, or if you've already got one, comment below. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this particular gun. I hope you enjoyed this program. Please like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram. Don't forget, hit the subscribe button. It really helps us to give you content like this. And we will see you on the next one. Thank you for watching.